I'll be presenting a case of EUS guided pancreaticogastrostomy for pancreatic leak. A middle aged male with history of diabetes, hypertension, alcohol use disorder, presented with acute pancreatitis secondary to alcohol use with portal wine vein thrombosis. Pancreatic ascites was identified but did not respond to conservative management with nasogeginal feeding and octreotide. A CT scan showed presence of ascites in the abdomen. An ERCP was attempted, but a stent could not be placed due to angulation and stricture. We decided to offer the patient EUS guided pancreaticogastrostomy as illustrated in this figure. Under EUS examination, the pancreas parenchyma was carefully examined from the neck region around to the body and tail. There were several small peripancreatic collections as well as vessels which were the collaterals from portal vein thrombosis. The pancreatic duct in the neck was non-dilated measured 1.6 millimeters and then in the body tail region measured 1.9 millimeters. Next we advanced a 19 gauge needle across the gastric wall into the pancreatic duct in the body. Contrast was injected to confirm presence of the needle in the pancreatic duct. Next, a Terumo 0.032 inch guide wire was advanced into the PD. We performed Doppler to check for vessels and uh, there was a vessel in proximity. We had to be extra careful. Then we advanced a cystotome across the gastric wall create the fistula and then across the pancreatic parenchyma gradually it was eventually advanced into the pancreatic duct successfully. Contrast was injected and demonstrated a leak in the tail of pancreas. Next, we proceeded with placement of a five French PD stent. And as you see with uh, much difficulty, gradually the stent was advanced across the gastric wall and the pancreatic parenchyma into the PD. And this is the endoscopic view demonstrating the deployment of the stent in the gastric lumen. Now you'll just see the coil. And on the fluoro, you see the stent in the PD down to the tail and the loop in the gastric lumen. Post procedure, patient had an episode of pancreatitis which responded with conservative management. Patient had gradual resolution of ascites, and uh, four weeks later, patient presented with no residual ascites and was completely asymptomatic. I'll just show you the CT scan post procedure, and you see this is a stent in the pancreatic duct. Thank you.